Lauren, which is vegan, and where in each episode we try to look at a different aspect of the vegan lifestyle, and oh yeah, we're gonna do what we do most of the time. We're gonna get our grub on, and we are going to be trying products from Plantside. And if you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe because believe me, you do not want to be missing out on these deliciously good times. So, what we will be eating today, now this is what Plant Side does. I didn't want to say it in the intro because I wanted that element of suspense, but they make vegan Yorkshire puddings, yes! So we'll be having a vegan Yorkshire pudding and they also do vegan toad in the holes. Oh my goodness! I am so insanely excited about this because a lot of times when I go out for roasts, especially at places that are not like a just vegan pub, um, <sighs> The, the thing they always leave out, they're like, oh yeah, we can make a nut roast and have the roasted veggies and roasted potatoes, but they always leave out the Yorkshire pudding because they don't know how to make them. But guess what? Plant Side has done it! <sighs> okay, I'm very, very excited. Now, for those of you out there who might not be from the UK that don't know what a Sunday roast is, it's amazing. But what it is, it's like you have roasted vegetables, roasted potatoes, and obviously people that eat meat, they have meat dishes, but we don't do that. So a lot of times there might be a vegan Wellington or maybe a vegan nut roast. And then what a lot of people tend to leave out because they don't know how to veganize it is the Yorkshire pudding, which is kind of this like pastry-esque. Anyway, it simply is heaven. When I first moved from the US to the UK, I, I literally fell in love with the Yorkshire pudding. So I, you can only imagine, as you could tell, how excited I am that it's vegan. <laughs> anyway, let's get to eating. <laughs> Okay, plant side, you have done it. <gasps> okay, I, oh man, I have missed a Yorkshire pudding, that is for sure. And kind of as I mentioned earlier, it's like a lot of times you do go to vegan pubs for a nice Sunday roast, and that is the one thing they always keep off because they just don't know how to make one. They don't know how to make a good one. There are a few vegan pubs that I've been to, and they have done a good job, but I have to admit, plant side has boom. It's like, it's, it's still in first place. Now, my partner who isn't entirely vegan, so she will have roasts with a normal Yorkshire pudding, and of course she tried this one, and she was so impressed. She's like, this is definitely the best one she has eaten, the best vegan one she has tried. You all are gonna wanna get it in your face. Wow, okay, the excitement is really real. You know, a Sunday roast, it isn't complete without a Yorkshire pudding because it's just such a British classic, and I am so grateful to have something, well, that tastes exactly like the real thing. And guess what? No animals harmed in the process. Now, you could order your plant side Yorkshire puddings and toad in the holes uh, via, well, on, on, online, and they could be sent to you. So very, very easy, perfect for the Sunday roast. The toad in the hole, really, really good as well. And they make that with This Isn't Sausage, which was just completely wonderful, delightful, and a piece of British cuisine that I have really missed, and I am so happy that I could be happily fulfilled now. Oh yes, and my roasts are going to be loving me. Now time out, I don't know if I should do this, but I was wondering, because there's a few pubs we like to go to, and I like their roasts, and their vegan roasts, you know, they don't, they don't include the Yorkshire pudding because they don't know how to make it. So I'm wondering if I have something like these plant side things. Do you think it's rude if I like bring it there and just see if they could make my vegan one and put it on my roast? What do you think? Let me know in the comments. I think it's fine. Why not? I need, I need my uh, delightful roast as well. <laughs> Ooh, another thing really exciting that you could also do these in an air fryer. I don't know, I think I mentioned before I recently got an air fryer and I love it. So these Yorkshire puddings and toad in a holes, they could go in the oven or air fryer. Boom! <laughs> and everyone, as always, thank you so much for watching and please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to Just Veganin and follow me on Instagram at Just Veganin.